Here's a Nokia G21. I'm going to show you how to transfer your files such as photos and videos directly from the G21 to any Chromebook, okay? To the Chromebook's hard drive. Nothing to do with the Google Cloud, okay? We want it on the hard drive of your Chromebook. And we're going to be using the charging cable that comes with the Nokia G21. It's a USB-A to a USB-C. So here's my Chromebook here, USB-A. I'm going to plug that into my USB port right there. And now I'm going to go ahead and grab my phone. And I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. Hit that. Go ahead and sign in. Let me use my face. Okay, now this screen sh here should pop up right away. Okay, if this pops up, you can see by default it's ch automatically checked by down here. It says no data transfer. What you want is file transfer. Okay. The thing is, if this button, if this window here didn't pop up, just make sure you sign into your phone and then slide down notifications from the top. And then on the very bottom here, you see Android system charging this device via USB. Tap on that, and then under here it says tap for more options. Okay, we'll tap this again right there. And then again, this window here will pop up. And what we want is this file transfer. Okay, so once I tap on that, now something should pop up here. Okay, so it says open uh, files app. Now, so you want to go ahead and open your files app. If you didn't get that right there, you can just go to the start button here and just type in files. Mine's right there, but you can also just type in files and it's right there. Let's go ahead and open that up now that my phone's like all connected. So from here now, if we just look on here, now I don't know why, but my Nokia G21, they're calling it this IQ449. So let me go ahead and click on that right there. Okay, now right here, all the folders that are on my Nokia, okay, for my photos and videos, I want to go to the DCIM folder right here. So I'm going to double click DCIM, and I'm going to double click on camera. Now I only have a few photos and videos here, okay, it looks like I have uh, five photos and one video. I know that they're photos because it has the JPG extension, JPEG extension. I know it's a video file if it has a vid in the front or an extension .mp4, okay. So from here now, remember this is not a Windows computer. So it's not like I can go ahead and drag and drop this photo. Like if I try to drag and drop it onto my desktop and let go, it's gonna wing it back down. So what you have to do is this. Now you can see under, um, over here on the left, under my files, you see the download, downloads folder here. Any, everything under, inside my files is on your hard drive. So what we can do is we can make a new folder under my files. So let's go to my files here. And let's just go ahead and create a new folder. So I'm going to create a new folder, and I'll just name this one Nokia. So now there's Nokia, okay? So now from here, I can go ahead and drag and drop whatever I want, okay? I'll just do the whole shebang here. So I'm going to highlight all of them, and I'm going to drag and drop to this folder I called Nokia. I'm going to let go, and just wait for it to transfer. Usually you get something that pops up here saying that it's complete, but let me see, let me click on Nokia here. Okay, yeah, it's already transferred. So you can see I can go ahead and even uh, unplug my phone and that folder called Nokia is right there. And here's my uh, videos and my photos that are on my hard drive of my Chromebook now, okay? So pretty simple. Any questions or issues, just comment below, all right? Good luck, guys.